Hey, I'm walking over here to the train station. It's about a 15 minute walk at my pace, which I kind of walk kind of fast. Uh, I don't know when the next train is. Don't know what's going on, but it's hot. It's very hot and I'm wearing black, but it's my boy Spencer's shirt. So I will take the sacrifice. Uh, cocktails by Spence. If you like making cocktails or if you just like bartending in general and you want to learn, Go check him out he's got a youtube channel and uh he does like a box that he ships to you um every month and you get like cocktail stuff bar tools and new recipes uh highly recommend it go check it out used to work with the man he knows what he's talking about make some great de delicious drinks make you know look like you know what you're doing in the bar all right talk to you soon decided to come to the park. Uh, this is uh, Teganuma Lake or Lake Teganuma Park. Um, it's kind of cool. There's like a little kids train over there. Uh, some guy like drives it. I see their parents and kids riding it. Seems kind of cool. Then over here we've got boats and like flamingo swarms that you can rent and pedal out into the middle of the lake. It's quite interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna walk around here. I'll show you guys what I'm seeing and uh, yeah, stay tuned. All right, so I just came upon this, and uh, this is actually pieces of the Hiroshima uh, City Hall before the uh, nuclear explosion that happened there. Um, and uh, this is like a monument of peace. And uh, here in Abiko, they actually have plaques that are talking about peace and a city of peace. And it says that, like down here, we demand the complete abolition of all nuclear weapons. We appeal to the governments of the nations to protect the lives and safety of their all of their citizens. And it dated December 3rd, 1985. Wow, I was not expecting to come across something like this today. It's super pretty. And over on this side, you actually have like an explanation. I can't read Japanese yet. I'll translate it later. I took pictures. more of the lake walk to the end of the park some boats out there maybe there's people making out in them or doing other things drinking heavily maybe I don't know some people fishing some people sleeping this is what the park looks like there's also some art thing going on right back there I don't know looks like balls in a basket I'll see if I can get it closer. Yeah. all right 
So it looks like it's going to be an art walk, and it started a couple days ago, and it's going to go through the end of the month. I don't know, but uh, these baskets look kind of cool. Maybe some birds, maybe? I don't know what these are either. These look like nests or something. Random hair wigs? Eh, who knows? Check that out. We've got these over here too. Yeah, cool. All right, so I've stumbled across another monument. Um, let's see what it's all about. We've got this right here. It's all written in Japanese. No idea what it says. But then you come over here and you have this monument written in English. And it says, I've seen a vision of the marriage of East and West. Far off, down the halls of time, I heard a childlike voice. How long? How long? By B Bernard Leach. Check that out. I don't know if you can see that or not. Then it has like some guy maybe holding a bell. Uh, that's kind of cool. All right, so I decided to leave the park. Um, it was fun, but it was time to leave. I don't know what I'm going to get into now, so I'm walking. I think I'm going to try and walk home. It's like 4.4 kilometers. It says it's going to take me like 55 minutes. Let's see what we see on the way. Just hanging out in the countryside. I'm almost home. I think I'm going to stop at a Gambini before I go.